Good morning everyone. How are you all? I hope you all are fine. I am going to tell a story. Before I tell a story, I would like to ask a question. Do you like playing or watching a game? I hope your answer is playing a game. But there are some who want to only watch the game. But there are some others who want to play as well as watch the game. Which game do you like the most? Cricket or football? Which game do you think is mostly watched by the most people in the world? Cricket or football? Cricket is watched and played in India. All over India, children like to play cricket. What about football? Football is ignored in India by most people. It is not well known to the Indians. Indian children but football is a game is played all over the world cricket is a game played by the by the two teams of 11 members with a ball and bat and wickets and pads whereas football is played with two teams of 11 members uh, they will kick the ball or heading the ball into the opponent's go court. So, football is played all over the world. More than 200 countries football is played. Whereas cricket is played more than 100 countries. In 100 countries, uh, cricket is played. You know, cricket is played in India, in some of the Asian countries like uh, Sri Lanka, Bangladesh, Pakistan and uh, um, Nepal and also Afghanistan, some other uh, Australian, some other continents, Australia and South Africa, England. In those countries we see uh, cricket is mostly watched as played but whereas uh, Football is played all over the world, throughout the world, more than 200 countries like it are watched. Nearly 250 million people watch football, as cricket is watched 1.2 million people. So, cricket is uh, less watched or football is watched by many people all over the world. Now, we will learn in India. Uh, we don't often see play children playing football, but let us learn, let us see how football is played, uh, how football is taught in schools. Let us see. In this story, I am going to uh, tell uh, about uh, the story. The story name is uh, Colorful Shoes. Okay, here, uh, this is a unique story. Usually, football is played by the men or the boys, but here there are some girls who are more uh, uh, excited to play football. Here we see here uh, six girls, and here is a coach, PE teacher, physical education teacher, PE teacher, Mr. Louis, and he is teaching the uh, children football lessons. Now to, in today we are going to learn how uh, football teacher, this uh, coach, football coach, Mr. Louis, PE teacher, Louis is going to teach uh, his uh, school children football lessons we are going to learn. Let's get into the story. Once upon a time there was a school. In that school there was a P teacher, physical education teacher, whose name is Louis. Louis spelling L E W Lou I S E S. Louis, Mr. Louis, is a physical education teacher, P E teacher. He wants to teach his school children, mostly favorably girls, football. In rare cases, we see girls learning football. In this school, 
this PE teacher, Mr. Lewis, is going to teach football. How? You know, he first told his attender to inform the children that next week onwards uh, they are going to learn football lessons. So this PE teacher informed this attender, he is attender here with the envelope covers, envelope covers, here in envelope covers are the, the covers uh, which are used to keep the letters to send through post. So he is attender here, attender. Attender has written all the letters and kept all the letters in the envelopes and now he is calling the girls and now after he called the girls all the girls all the sexy girls and um, all the uh, school girls came near to this attender now he informed them hello girls here is a good news for you today i am going to share a good news yeah, there is a good news to you, he said. When he said good news, all oh, everybody were eagerly waiting what that good news would be. Your PE teacher, Mr. Lewis, has given me this envelope, and he told me to give you. You are going to take this envelope cover, and this a letter is there. You have to take this letter and give it to your parent you have to take and give it to your parent and you are not allowed to open it now in school don't open it now he said and all the children took that envelope cover envelope cover so uh, it is uh, like this it will be just wait Is the envelope cover so like this envelope cover he has taken that one and given to the all the girls all the girls taken that envelope cover and they went eagerly to home oh, to show to their parents here is a gen you have to observe clearly about this gen what Jen is going to do in the story we are going to see now here. Jen is a girl who went home soon after she went home. She had given the letter to her father. Father, Dad, quickly open it. There is a good news in this envelope. Our Louis, uh, our PE teacher, told us to see after going home. Dad, please open it she said after she said like that jen's father here is a jen here see jen's father said first to say hello to me then i will open then jen said oh, hello dad and then he opened in that he found envelope cover it is written that here next week onwards all the girls of this school are going to start learning football lessons the moment she hears that news about football lessons jen was so much excited oh really we are going to learn football lessons okay then i am so happy to learn I can score 15 goals. Then father said, yes, you can score 15 goals. Usually in football game, uh, children or players cannot make uh, more goals. Like in cricket, cricket they score 100, half century, a century they score. But in football, they can't make many goals. Anyway, like a few goals, 5, 10, like that, goals they can score. But here is a girl who is more excited. She told them, I can score 15 goals. Then father also encouraged, yes, you also, you can score if you can try. Father said, then she was uh, thinking about the football game deeply. 
father also said here not only that and you are also given a football for each one here is a football for each player each student each girl the a football is given to practice at home in the evenings ah uh, so for that jen was again more excited to hear about that one and she was feeling so happy and then she is thinking ah oh, we have football to play at home in the evening what about jersey jersey and shoes with studs like real uh, fifa football players can we have like that she asked her father her father picture is not uh, drawn in this on this board and our father jens father said tomorrow we are going to see your, your P teacher said not to uh, get jersey he did not mention about anything uh, about jersey he only told uh, the students to buy only shoes football shoes and then uh, father said tomorrow we are surely going uh, to uh, to market to buy shoes for you your a pair of good pair of shoes we are going to for you uh, he said when he said jen said okay dad tomorrow we will go then at that time after completed that next day she went to meet her friends so when she met here uh, tessy and uh, tessy was asking they are playing outside and tessy called this uh, jen do you want to play with us jen said no i am not going to play today now i am off to, i dad, my dad and i are off to go to market to buy a new pair of football shoes she is eagerly telling about uh, going to market and buying shoes when she said uh, one of the one of her friends said oh we have, we have uh, we have bought uh, our, our shoes already then she was also more excited again uh, getting her shoes and she went along with her father jen into market and now we can see how the conversation went on in the market uh, jen and jen's father uh, with the shopkeeper or the vendor who is selling shoes in the market we are going to see in the market what happened after they were, they reach the market there are different type of shoes different colors different sizes at the road side vendor selling come come there are different color shoes red yellow blue green all types all colors come and take low cost very cheap he was giving by shouting a loud advertisement on the street but here jen did not want to purchase the shoes at the road side uh, even though they are more colorful uh, shoes uh, she wants the shoes which real football players wear she asked her father dad i don't want to hear i want the real football shoes and let us go to some other uh, shop and they went to a big shop but in that shop they tried on all the shoes but they are not uh, fit either the size is not fit or they are very costly so again they came back to the same person uh, from whom they crossed in the beginning and the colorful shoes at the road side again they came to that place after searching all the shops they got tired again father also said good shoes can't make many goals even if you uh, buy costly shoes you cannot you will not make many goals he said and again they came back to the uh, former uh, roadside uh, uh, seller and there again they started uh, bargaining asking uh, again that person said you can never get anywhere in the world better than the shoes which i am going to sell here so here are the best pair for you 
uh, which you can uh, which which can be fit for you and uh, which you, you will be able to kick the ball very well so you take the sh uh, shoes from me he said and the girl is saying uh, are your shoes like uh, real football player shoes uh, do you have real football players shoes here but the girls want only those shoes uh, uh, which real football players play then he said here there are many colors and different kinds which will fit to your feet you can select i have for you take this one this one will fit for, to your feet and you can play very well then very nice colorful shoes she bought and they took it and afterwards they left from that place from the market they went to home afterwards when they come to school the following week and the next week they came to the ground and there and the pe teacher is ready to make them to play and he kept all the things which are related to the uh, football and he kept uh, he kept in the ground all the shin pads and he told them to wear all the things uh, socks uh, uh, shorts uh, shoes uh, and whatever the thing what are things are required for the football team and he told them to wear and come in line into the uh, uh, court into into the ground and he told them to report to the court and everybody they came in line and at that time they saw each other's shoes i bought colorful shoes oh now the lesson name is like that a colorful shoes okay at this uh, 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 said jen to see this girl is saying jen your sh shoes are like mine and then and uh, jen also said uh, okay not only yours and here pa uh, pams and uh, shilly is also like uh, yours only so we all bought the same color shoes and the uh, pe teacher said so you all five members bought our same color and then one of the children said not only they bought our uh, same color uh, say same uh, same type of shoes they are all belong to back street colony and then pe teacher said if they all belong to one colony and then i can i can uh, give them a name that uh, back street heroes they can play for one team every time they can practice at home and they will be in one team and then since then they play in one team and uh, he also said back street heroes will win the match and when they were playing with the other opponent team and already back street back street heroes in gen already scored five goals i th and then he uh, pe teacher said today back street uh, heroes are going to win the game jenny is telling yes why not we will win i already scored five goals and also uh, i will become one day a fifa football player i will become a real football player she said and then uh, uh, your pe teacher also said yes surely you can you can win so if you continue to play like this here in this lesson we can learn that here uh, re, uh, costly shoes will not score many goals because uh, if we having uh, good shoes you, one cannot uh, one can uh, cannot uh, score goals even without uh, costly shoes normal shoes also he can score goals so that depends on uh, your intelligence and your courage and determination we can score goals not just by buying good shoes you can uh, i can score uh, goals okay even buying good books will not gain knowledge by doing hard work will gain knowledge i hope you understood the moral of the story thank you okay bye